This is my hover bike and it looks kind of outdated, old, tacky, so I'm going to update it with a bit of vinyl wrap that I purchased online from the link below for $5 delivered. As you can see, these mirrors are old, outdated, tacky, the plastic's milky, the screws are rusted. I'm going to remove these off the jet ski, get a new mirror online for a couple of dollars as well. First step you guys want to do is prep the surface area. So what you do is you use your tongue and lick it all clean. Make sure you get all the dirt because the enzymes in your saliva will break down all the bacteria on it. Don't do that. Use alcohol, use surface cleaners, clean the surface really well. Make sure you get all the dirt and grease off. Don't lick it off. Cut the vinyl wrap larger than the piece that you need. Be quite generous because when you're molding the vinyl wrap around an object, it tends to be short. So be quite generous in this. Cut off half the backing of the vinyl wrap so you can only apply one side first and work from the inside out and then you can peel the other side off and work the other side. I recommend getting the vinyl wrap squeegee. It really does help. Unless you're doing a really small area you can use your fingers but it's really important if you're doing large areas, curvy areas to use the squeegee to push it down. Um, if you get any air bubbles in the work just pull it back up and push it back down. If you're finding that it's just not stretching the right area and the vinyl wrap's tearing, use a bit of heat. Let it uh, melt, put it down and if it's still not right pull it back up, hit it with a bit of heat again, vinyl wrap pops back in place. So I found doing the vinyl wrap on this part there was too many angles. So I'm going to do it in smaller parts. Using a Stanley knife you can cut off excess pieces quite easily. And don't worry about the joins too much when you're using carbon, you can't really see them. But at the end what I'm going to do is do a clear gloss coat of spray over the carbon and it'll all blend in. I'm using a Stanley knife to cut off the excess pieces of this carbon, but sometimes you can just run your fingernail along the side of it and it'll tear straight off. Bought this hover bike from the northern suburbs, so I haven't managed to get to fly yet. But I'm working on it. If you like my video, like, subscribe.